from Curly B and today I'm just going to be showing you three really quick styles for summer so whether you're going to festivals or outings or exhibitions these are three simple styles that you can do on your natural hair okay so start from mid style number one which I'm causing calling easy breezy pineapple basically you just have to section off your bang area like so and simply twist and pin your bang area to one side and I usually like these kind of styles because they um, though my hair is out they're a little more protective because my ends are tucked away and then using um, just a piece of uh, tights that I've cut into a strip I'm just using it to tie my hair up and I do like this way because I can adjust how big the tie is so that's it just tie it from the back push it upwards and as you push it upwards push your um, hair slightly to the side just to create a slightly different look and you're more or less done also add the little pin just to uh, secure the ends of the, the tights and that's it just adjust your hair until it suits you and you can even put um, an accessory or you can leave it plain you can dress it up dress it down there's lots of different options there so that's the first style <laughs> Okay, so I've called this style the double twist puff and again it's a really easy style, a little bit different and, but still really easy to do. You'll need to know how to flat twist which is really easy, loads of YouTube videos you can watch on flat twisting. So again you just need to section off your bang area at the front. And now what you need to do is make a small parting, I would say about an inch wide going down and you're going to flat twist this area and with this twist you're going to pin it across. First you need to just flat twist this area and then pin it away. Okay so the next thing to do is to uh, make a parting on both sides starting from the crown of your head to um, just below the flat twist that you did. Um, the front of your head and then all you need to do is to flat twist this section starting from the front and work your way to the crown and you need to do this on both sides check everything is neat and if you need um, you know obviously to moisturize your hair then they use your favorite leave-in conditioner and seal with an oil or a butter for flat twisting just to add extra moisture if it's going to be a, a really hot day, let's say. Okay, so now what you're going to do is you're going to take your first flat twist you're just going to bring it across the um, rest of your bang area and just pin it up by the side. And then you're going to take your loose hair and a bit like in the first style you're just going to twist it a little bit at the ends and tuck it under and pin it in place on top of the end of the flat twist, the first flat twist that you did. Okay, now it's time to pin down the two side flat twists that you did. So, you're going to take one side and just bring it across to the beginning of your first flat twist and tuck it under and just pin it away. And again, take 
the other flat twist and put it onto the other side just tuck it away and I would really recommend using really good bobby pins for this um, sometimes I forget to replace my bobby pins and they've chipped and they've lost all their black um, covering and then you can see um, the ends of the bobby pins in your hair um, so it's best to just make sure that your bobby pins do have all their black um, coating on them they're not chipped or anything like that then they can really hide uh, they can really be hidden okay so with the back area of your hair um, you could actually just leave it out like this and just put an accessory in that could be another style and I forgot to say I'm doing um, all these styles using uh, on an old flat twist um, sorry on an old um, old two strand twist twist out so that's why I've got a bit of curl definition there but there's no need to at all you can have it on a perhaps sh shrunken hair whatever you like really whatever looks good on you so yeah you can leave it like this but for this style um, what I'm going to do is get um, my piece of tight and simply tie up the back to make a high bun and then also if it's a hot day then you don't have the you don't have your hair on your neck um, making you hot so yeah just simply tie it up and that's about it style number three and I'm calling this style fun in the sun bun so again you need to start off by sectioning off your bang area and then section it off again into four separate sections and flat twists as you can see in the video just flat twist them down once you've done this just pin it away and we're going to work on the back area first so um, because I would like a bit more of a slick down look use my styler made mainly of sheer butter and aloe vera gel and just apply that to my edges. Take my piece of tights again, love my tights, and just tying up the bun at first. And again just pin away any ends so that they can't be seen. Easy. Okay so now what you're going to do is make six sections, just really roughly. Um, so make three at the front, one in the middle, and two more at the back. And you're going to do, um, I think it's called the China bump sort of style. So just taking each section, you're going to twist really lightly at the ends. Taking a bobby pin, you're going to just take it backwards and pin it right at the root. Right, so and you're going to do this to each section until you've got lots of bumps on your big bun. Okay, so once you've done that, you're going to undo your flat twist at the front. And what you can do um, you can just leave your bang area out like this if you like and again just accessorize I'm gonna put on a scarf it's an African print scarf I'm just gonna tie it around and I really love these scarves um, you can create lots of different uh, shapes with them so to create this um, the shape I'm going to do, you just simply tie it round, twist the ends, and what you're going to do is create two circles next to each other. So you're just going to twist it round, just twist it round itself, I would say one and a half times, and then you're just going to take the end and create another circle twisting the other way. making sure your ends are still twisted tuck it 
anything in the middle and if it won't stay again just use your bobby pins there we are done now you could just leave your hair out like this and that can be a style um, as you know I love to just tuck away my um, ends in my bang area just keep it out of my face and so I like to just sweep it to one side and pin it and I love the volume that flat twists give you especially when they're chunky chunky flat twists so there you go just pin it really loosely at the side and your style is done the fun in the sun bun done Hope you enjoyed that. Uh, enjoy your summer. Thanks for watching. Bye.